What's up guys? This is Hylian Mum and today in Grounded I'm going to show you how to find the Minotaur Maze Key so you can get the Picnic Burgle Chip. You're going to need the Bone Dagger to cut roots, a Brat Burst if you haven't blown up the rock by the Leaning Shovel, and a Insect Hammer if you have not knocked down the handle of the lunchbox on the picnic table. We're going to start here at the Mysterious Machine in the middle of the map. We're going to go directly to the left over to the rock wall, and if you have not located it yet there is a cassette tape right here and that is where we are going to put our first marker is right on that cassette tape from the mysterious machine that should take you in the direction of the very first field station that you find in game when you start i usually stick to the left of it takes me to the left of this big rock here over on the right there is the red ant hill. That is a big ant. We're going to keep going till we come to this clearing here. Now right ahead there you have a little cluster of dandelions. That is a stink bug nest. There is often four or five of that live around there. So you just want to be careful of them. They can be roaming over on this side occasionally. Further to the left is the haze where you will need your gas mask or you will be poisoned. So I'm just going to continue forward, looking out for my stink bugs. Luckily, there's none on this side right now. And there we go. So ahead, we can see the cassette tape is coming in. And right over there is a wolf spider nest. So you are aware there is a wolf spider that often sleeps there. We're going to go up to the top of the cassette. Open our map. Go more to the left to this patch of water that is right between the picnic table and the sandbox here. And we're going to put our marker here. There are bombardiers in this area, so just be wary of them. It should take you right past the leaning shovel that we will come back to once we have the key. And here at the patch of water, we have a exposed pipe over there. So we're just going to go in through the crack here. To the left, you'll have some brittle marble. To the right, you have some brittle quartzite. And also to the right, you have a crack in the bottom of the pipe here. So we're going to go down here and to the left, where it will take us a very short distance to some roots here, where the Minotaur maze is hiding there. You will not need a guild tube. But you can do this in one breath. Grab the key, and out we go. Now that we have the key, we're going to go right back over to the leaning shovel that we passed. You can see it right there in the distance also. We're going to get our brat burst out. Lay it on this thing. Oh, step back. And boom. Now we have a way up to the picnic table. Once you're at the top, we're going to go to the left, and we're going to go all the way to the end of the seat behind this yellow lunchbox. It is a good thing when you come up here to have a tuft, because, you know, if you do fall, it's good to not die. I'm starting to think that the whole world is just it. Once we're at the end, we're going to go to the left, or to the right, behind the plate here, to the spork. And we're actually going to be using this little wood piece to cross over to the other seat. But you need to deal with these bees, because they will always aggro you. And it is rather annoying, so it's easier for me, at least, to just snipe them and get them dealt with. Oh, you gotta love it when all the little shots... Stop dodging. Thank you. Alright, now we're gonna go on to our little spork here. And we're gonna cross right over in peace. Jump up on the nail. Over to the books. We're gonna go to the right, up the books. And this is where we're gonna need our insect hammer. 
Uh, this is the Black Ox Hammer, which is the Tier 3, but at least a Tier 2 Insect Hammer. So you can bust the handle and get a nice clear path right up to the picnic table. There we go. And then there off to the left will be the Minotaur Maze. So just jump over the crack here, don't fall down. Seeing them at this scale gives you a totally different perspective. And you go in the maze like at the first area here. We're going to turn to the left and go all the way to the wall. Turn to the right. Go all the way to the door that is on your right. Go through the door that all the way to the end of a weird ant -Man. where there is a door on the left. And straight through there is the treasure chest that we want to get to. Now, it is guarded by two bees, so you do have to kill these guys as well. There we go. Uh, usually you can use the door somewhat to try to help you avoid their attacks. Because they are rather annoying. There we go, one down. Oh, man, he got me with that one. He really decided to stretch. I don't know why I did Oh, no stamina? Maybe. Alright, we killed the two bees. Now we can go over to the treasure chest here, where we have the Minotaur Maze key. We can unlock it. We have a Mega Milk Molar right up here we can get. We've got some brittle and sturdy marble. You can get in the chest. We've got some pretty and sturdy quartzite over here. A scabby Mega Milk Molar and our wonderful Burgle Chip. Picnic Burgle Chip. And there we go. So hopefully that helps anybody who has been looking for this stuff. Uh, as always, guys, be kind, stay legendary. May the Triforce always be with you. Eileen Mom, out.